We have always been interested in early language learning processes going on in institutionalized as well as in commercial schools and preschools. Especially Helen Duran early learning centers attracted us much because of their outstanding reputation. So we wanted to know what's behind the concept. The research covered two parts of investigation. First, we did some empirical qualitative field work at 10 selected Helen Duran learning centers in Germany at the beginning of this year. Our aim was to gain an in-depth insight into the research context of the project. In a second step, we carried out an empirical quantitative investigation for one month at mid-year. This included a total of over a thousand people who took part, 280 children and 758 parents. What we wanted to find out was how do children learn English in the specific context of the Helen Duran learning centers. And number two was what are the impacts of this particular Helen Duran method on the development of skills in foreign language learning, on social skills and learning strategies in the child's later school career. While visiting, we found out that the variation of activities, especially with the younger ones, follows psychological findings concerning individual concentration spans. The individual treatment of the children is outstanding particularly praiseworthy is, for example, the gender-specific differentiation of the activities. In groups consisting solely of boys, there is a greater concentration on games involving movement. The center's resources are equipped appropriately, a clear advantage over state institutions. All teachers at the centers remain monolingual all the time, a clear teaching principle, the immersive approach and without any simplification of the target language. Positive feedback is given very often and in a wide variety of ways. In all the centers, the teacher's lively enthusiasm was impressive, a clear precondition for the kids to enjoy learning English. The children's voluntary participation is a central tenet of the motivational concept. However, the child is still constantly invited to actively join in. The teachers encourage the pupils to speak as much as possible, or if too young to speak, to show their understanding. The level of progress in all the courses visited was comparatively high. Our findings of the quantitative analysis was as well impressive. Most children attended primary school or were even not yet at school. A second large proportion attended gymnasium, which is the highest level of secondary school in Germany. More than half of the parents are academically qualified. This explains the intellectual willingness to support either early learning at preschool age or extra tuition later when necessary. The most ideal age to start learning a foreign language as a young child is three years. The average starting age at Helen Duran centers is approximately four years. That's fantastic. Some important details. The younger children are, when they start attending Helen Duran courses, the better their final half year school report is likely to be. It is also remarkable that Helen Duran early English courses clearly contribute to the fact that repeatedly and continually taking part in the courses leads to better grades in the subject at state schools. Over 94% of the children find the Helen Duran courses very enjoyable. They extremely like what they do there. We also asked the participants about materials, topics and methods. Both children and adults rated all of these as either very good or good. Over 60% of the children feel that the courses have had a positive impact on their performance at school. These kids are completely sure that the courses give them an advantage over their fellow pupils. 20% more are strongly convinced that the courses have given them more self-confidence and also confidence in their linguistic ability. 91% feel at home and secure in English. 
The majority of children, over 80%, are convinced that the Helen Duran courses have facilitated their transition to secondary education. The positive result given by the children is confirmed by the parents' answers. Almost 95% of them consider their children to be well equipped for the transition by Helen Duran courses. All respondents generally relate their success, whether past or future, to attending Helen Duran courses. What is astonishing is that the key factor to this is not just the increased ability in English, but also, indirectly, the metacognitive skills acquired and specific strategies and techniques for language learning. What we can concludingly say is that over 80% are very satisfied or satisfied with their children's success. The general satisfaction level even stands at over 97%. What a benchmark for English language learning at state schools.